Well, hi folks, here we are again. I've got another little bowl. I'm going to carve it out again with my little sharpened blade. I'm going to try. I've been trying a few different designs and stuff, just trying to see what what looks best. And you never know until you try. So I'll try a different a different shape one this time. Just try some little sort of arches like that for the first row. I'll do that all the way around. Which way is the best way to go? Probably that way. I'll try and get it as fine so that they just about touch at the bottom, but obviously they can't touch otherwise it would drop to pieces. Oops. So I'll go all the way around doing doing some little arches like this and then show you what it looks like. Then in between I'll fill in the little gaps with a little one as well. So we've got a a nice fine bit of carving if it doesn't break. So I'll put my glasses on. I keep forgetting to put my specs on because I can't see otherwise. Right, put them on. Oh, I can see it now. So I'll speed it up, get round to the end of the first row, show you what it looks like, and then uh, start doing the other bits. So we're coming round to the end of the first row now, so I reckon I can probably get about three more in there. So I'll just try and I'll just put a little mark where I'm going to start them off from. So I'll do one in the middle, and then one there, and then one there, and hopefully they should match. So I'll do the one in the middle first, then I can split the difference with the other two. Like I said, there's no measurements. The only measurements I've got are two little scratch marks there, just so I can get the height of them than this air. So I'll just do these in between. And then the final one. It's quite difficult because your arm's sort of hanging in fresh air, so I've got it rested in a little tub, but there's not a lot of stuff you can uh, you can do. Right, so that's the first the first row of them. I mean, it looks fine as it is like that. But again, I'm gonna I'm gonna just gonna try and get a bit carried away and just <clears throat> carve a little bit out of there so it's even finer. So I don't think I'll be able to go right down to the bottom, but we'll give it a go. Let's try and get it try and get it as fine as possible. Pot's getting a bit thin now, a bit weak because obviously there's not a lot of clay in it. You can see the rims distorting, so I'll have to be very careful. I'll be very careful when I push them out. So I'm going to do that all the way around. I'm looking for punishment. Oh, look at that, you can see it bending. I just have to go down to there with the rest of them. It's suddenly gone a bit floppy, it was quite. The clay was quite hard a bit ago, for some reason it's getting softer rather than harder. So. We'll see how we get on anyway. So I'll speed it up again and see if we can make it to the end without it dropping to pieces. I'll show you what it looks like when it's finished.
So I'll cut them to last two now. Unfortunately the last one won't match because if you look the others I didn't start at the bottom whereas the first one I went right down to the bottom because it must have been a little bit of a wider one but you'll not, you'll not notice as, as long as you don't check every one for size. So the last two, this has been a really fiddly one this, I must admit very delicate and not very stable at all. Down to the last one, hopefully don't ruin it now. Push it out, Ugh. and that's that. So that's another, another design, that's quite fragile that one, I must admit that is very fragile, delicate, so there's not much holding this pot together, it is so so fragile so I'll just let you have a look at the top of it if I can get my camera off show you what it looks like in the top view because that's where you get the best effect so that's that one looks quite like a sunflower I think something like that but it's that's one of the most delicate I've done I'll try and get it centered so it spins round properly so that's that one. I'm quite chuffed with that one actually. That's quite. I think that's one of the nicest ones I've done. Like I say, you just try different shapes and see what fits in where and uh, see what they end up like. Give it a go. That's about it folks.